Well, I mean, some of the stuff I learned, you know, from Drummers Collective as a student, but then, you know, working with, uh, you know, listening to a lot of records and doing uh, doing stuff like that, listening to Steve Gadd, do some orchestrations, and then kind of seeing where he was at, and then doing some of my own movements, and then later on seeing what Dennis Chambers did with some of his, and then, so, I mean, yeah, the, mas the basic Mozambique pattern, which we know is uh, the bell pattern. from the late Frank and Malabea Drummers Collective back in the mid to late 80s and uh, that was his orchestration of the Mozambique for drum set. So now uh, move things forward and, and that really comes from the timbali part which is So now let's do this. Okay. Now if we do this, we turn it, move that pattern around the drums up and down. We got a uh, a, uh, a halftime funk pattern, which would be this. That's the halftime movement. Okay, so now next, let's uh, orchestrate the right hand a little bit. Bring that down to the floor time. So we'll go back to this. Time, you can mix that up a little bit more. So we're going to put two eighth notes on the floor tom. We're going to do the first one and then the second one. So we'll have this. Okay, so we're going to throw that down there on the floor tom like that. Basically, kind of what, what what Steve Gadd did with Late in the Evening. So that's that same movement, you know, that same orchestration is what we do this. as well. Um, so now let's move that more into the into the into the funk realm. So you could do just basically the same pattern 
but we're gonna ghost a little bit and we're gonna add some bass drums so was, you know, the one. One of the things I like to do is, is take that one, and then we'll come back to the funk one, but since you were kind of alluding to that, and you, and you showed me what that was, right? So now we're going to orchestrate that with that one floor tom, though. space in there right so you got that little have to, have to work on that. <laughs> yeah that's you know that's a little funkasaurus for you right there now the um